can God break the laws of nature? Are miracles possible? And that's a very important question. I was once addressing 600 physicists in Britain and uh, they listened to my talk and one very bright physicist said at the end, he said, Professor Lennox, that was all very interesting, but you know, I perceive that you're a Christian. I said, you're really sharp. <laughs> and he said, no, he said, let's be honest. He said, this is crazy. If you're a Christian, you're obliged to believe that Jesus was God become human. Isn't that right? I said, absolutely right. He said, can you explain that to me? Well, I said, you've been asking all the questions. Can I ask you a few easier ones first as a physicist? Sure, he said. So I said, tell me, what is consciousness? I don't know. Okay, I said, let's take an easier thing. What is energy? Well, he said, we can measure it and use it. I said, that wasn't the question. You know it wasn't the question. What is energy? I don't know. Neither does the Nobel Prize winner Richard Feynman, by the way. Oh, I said, you don't know what they are. Tell me, do you believe in them? He said, yes. You believe in consciousness and you believe in energy. And you don't know what they are. I said, you're a crazy man. <laughs> I think, I said, I'll write you off as a physicist. He said, please don't. Well, I said, listen, you were prepared to write me off. because I couldn't explain to you the deepest mystery in the universe, how God become human. And you can't explain these vastly simpler things. And I said, let's pursue this a bit further. I said to him, um, why do you believe in these things when you don't know what they are? Well, that was a difficulty. So being very kind, I helped him. And I said, I think one of the reasons you believe in those concepts is that they have explanatory power. He said, that's right. Well, I said, that's one of the reasons I believe that Jesus was both God and human. I don't understand it. We don't even know what gravity is. But I believe it because it's the only explanation of the phenomena that makes sense. And now we come down to the final, what must be the final questions, because I'm getting old and you're getting tired. 